Here's another home improvement tip from Todd and Todd. So Todd, how do you know when it's time to replace your windows? Well, Todd, usually it's it's quite easy to tell when it's time to replace your windows, but in this house, a little harder. Here we are in South Milwaukee. This home was built in 1969 by the homeowner. And when you take a look at the condition of the window on the outside, it actually looks pretty good. The maintenance has been uh, kept up on the window and uh, it's in decent condition. Uh, most customers are replacing their windows because they find challenges with the operation of the window, cleaning of the window, um, many times air infiltration in the winter time, high heating and cooling costs, um, difficulty with cleaning, but uh, you know, this one is completely different, Todd. Tell us why this customer decided to replace these windows when they appear to be in decent condition. Well, like you said, this couple uh, actually built this home in 69, mm -hmm. and recently um, the, ho the homeowner's husband uh, had to go into a nursing home. So now she's faced with really the maintenance of her home and upkeep of her home by herself and and her sons mm -hmm. and her goal really is is to simplify her life and and accomplish a few things one is to make it easier to take care of the home so that there's you know very little maintenance to do for example mm -hmm. she's even changed her shower uh, changed her tub into a walk-in right shower mm -hmm. to make it easier to get in and out of there mm -hmm. she's changing her flower gardens taking those out resodding the the yard so right. that she doesn't have the upkeep of a garden mm -hmm. and the windows was an issue for her because you know the cleaning of the windows could only be done a couple times a year and she'd have to have someone else help her take care of that right. she wanted to be able to take care of her windows by herself and and actually keep them cleaner than she used to mm -hmm. you know four times a year so that was a major thing for her to have them actually tilt into the house to clean something she could handle her husband really did a beautiful job of taking care of the exterior and the interior you know he maintained the windows and and, and she didn't want the house to degrade um, or have to lean on family and friends to take care of those things. So having a maintenance-free window and an exterior trimmed vinyl window replacement system that really requires no painting or caulking or, or regular maintenance, just cleaning, yeah. all right, is really what she was after. Right, and it's very common nowadays to find a lot of families in that same situation, whether or not it's the children right. that are trying to help take care of mom and dad and make sure that they can stay in their homes as long as possible. I can relate because my, my own mother is in the same situation. I mean, her main goal in life is to stay in her home. She doesn't right. want to have to go to a nursing home um, she wants to, to, to stay there. So the steps are really, how do you make your home easier yeah. to take care of, right. all right, so that you can stay in there as long as you'd like. Right, and a lot of times, because the parents know the children are, are there on weekends helping out, mm -hmm. they want to eliminate that too. They don't want to feel like they're you know being a burden on any of the family members. So there's a lot of reasons that even though the windows are in a good shape on the outside of the home, really to replace them and make the home maintenance free, easier to clean. So uh, why don't we take a look at uh, some next steps and see how we're going to install the windows. Okay. So Todd, we've just about completed this installation. Why don't you bring us up to date what we've done so far? Okay, Todd, here's what we've done. First of all, there was a wooden storm window out on the outside. Mm -hmm. We took the storm window out on the outside and then it was butt up against a wooden stop that went uh, vertically on both the right and left sides. In order to get that out, we cut that out on each side. The window was custom made to fit the exact size opening. So we didn't have to alter anything with the interior woodwork or framing, which is really nice. So uh, once we had the opening prepared for the brand new window, we slid the window into place, tucked fiberglass insulation around the perimeter of it, 
And then before securing everything in place, we made sure it was level and plumb and square, secured the window into its place, made sure that everything operated smoothly, it could tilt in for easy cleaning, and what do we have left now? Well, actually, you probably saw uh, Mark actually clean the windows first, so right. that when we leave the job, we have clean glass. Yes. And then the final step really here is, he's going to make a custom cap for the exterior in a, with a, out of aluminum trim. So okay. what he does, Todd, is he takes measurements of all this, all this existing woodwork to get it exact. Then he has a machine called a brake press. He takes mm -hmm. the flat aluminum coil and he measures that out and he, he bends it and cuts it to make this custom cap so it fits this window perfectly. So once he uh, applies the new aluminum trim and he seals it, we've got a, a maintenance free exterior. And that's exactly what our customer asked for. Not only maintenance freedom, but this window designed to clean on the inside of the home so she can clean it more often with more ease and get rid of that old storm window on the outside. So uh, when, when we're finished with the aluminum trim, it's going to be absolutely gorgeous. So if you'd like additional information, just fill out the form right here on our website.